everybody. So, this is 10 things you could do during a snow day because it's a snow day right now. It snowed on top of the 30 centimeters we already got, which is, one second, I have a ruler. 30 centimeters, 12 inches. Besides this much, it snowed before, the size of my ruler. It snowed that much. On top of that, we got another 15 centimeters, which is another seven inches. So it snowed a lot and school's canceled and I need to put this down before I hurt myself. So this is 10 things you could do when you're home alone during a snow day. Number one, you could play a video game. Number two, you could film a video because no one's home right now because my grandparents stepped out and I have all filming time until they get back. So I'm trying to make the most of it. Number three is you can, if you're a girl, you're a girl. You can, uh, you can do your makeup, you can paint your nails, you can, uh, what do girly girls like to do? You can call your boyfriend, if you have a boyfriend. I don't have a boyfriend. It's just, yeah. Number four, you can go on Tumblr, or Instagram, or Facebook, or Twitter, and follow me, and like my stuff. Links will be below. Five is you can make hot chocolate. I'll do a hot chocolate making video if that's what you guys want because I make the best hot chocolate ever. It's true, it's been proven. And all of it. Not really. Number six! You can go outside and play in the snow. Because that's why it's there. The snow is there for you. The snow is your friend. It canceled school for you. That makes you buddies. Go outside, jump in that snow. The phone is ringing. One second. That was my mother. Anyway, the snow. Go jump in the snow. It's there for you. It canceled school for you. It's your friend. Go jump in it. Go make a snow angel. Go make a snowman. Do you want to build a snowman? Doesn't have to be a snowman. I just saw that. It was beautiful. It was just heart. Anyway, jump in snow. Build a snowman. Build an igloo. I know that there's a stereotype that. Canadians building igloos all the time and don't. It's just, it's hard to build an igloo. I don't know how people do it. I've never, I've never actually successfully built an igloo. I actually want to know how to do that. Anyway, numero seven, I think. Numero seven is you can sleep. Sleep is a beautiful, beautiful thing. My doors and the weight on my arms. Uh, yeah, you can sleep and it's very nice. I slept in. It's 12.28 right now. I slept until 11. Just woke up. I don't care. I'm in my pajamas, but I can't because it's a snow day. It's a snow day. Number eight. Number eight. Number eight is you can build something. Do something with your life. I don't know. What happened, what, what I did last snow day, because like I said, it snowed 30 centimeters before this 15 centimeters, but that snow had it melted. But when it did, when that did happen was uh, during the ice storm. So what I did was I have this frosted cupcake candle thing from Bath and Body Works. You probably saw it in my Christmasified My Room video or whatever I decided to call that. Anyways, my mom had Another one, which was Japanese flower thing, but she finished it, like the wicks wouldn't light anymore, so I emptied it out. There's still a little bit of wax in here, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill it with uh, rice and probably stick my, my, my makeup brushes in there. My nose is plugged. Number nine. Nine, nine, nine. If you could take a nice bath, a nice relaxing, melting bubble bath, because I got this thing from Lush, which I still haven't used. I got it on my birthday, which was around Christmas, and I used my bath bomb, but I didn't use my bubble bar. And it's, I don't know what it's called, but it smells like lavender and lemons, and I want to use it, and it has a rose. Who doesn't want a rose in their bathtub? 10. The final thing you can do when it's snow day is call up your friends, because it's their snow day too. For me, all my friends don't live in my neighborhood, so I'll just Skype them. We'll have a Skype party. It's very fun. Very fun. But if you do have friends who live around you and who don't mind trekking through the now, what's 30 plus 15? 
Wait. Wait. Forty-five. Now through the forty-five centimeters of snow. <laughs> if they don't mind trucking through the forty-five centimeters of snow, then have them come over, have a party, make hot chocolate for all of them, watch movies, do whatever, have a little snow day party. And yeah. So that's 10 things that you could do during a snow day. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. And like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram and Tumblr because that's really the only website that I'm on. Like I said, links will be below. And have an amazing snow day. Bye. Are you ready? Are you ready? Bam, snow. Snow. Look at the trees. Look at the beautiful trees. It's out of focus, but snow, 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 snow.